Is there anything like me, Green Bear? You hear the word no a lot. Allow me to demonstrate. Sorry, Teller. Yes, Green Bear? Can I have an entire chocolate cake for breakfast? No. Can I have an entire chocolate cake for lunch? No. Dinner? Still no. See? No. That little word with just two letters is always standing between me and what I want. It's also standing between you and really bad dietary choices. <clears throat> and also a really bad stomach ache. Ah! David, I really feel for you, bud. <sighs> well, let's see what David is up to. That no, David. Oh my gosh. Of course not. No, no, David, don't knock over the goldfish. By David Shannon. What are the chances that this is based on someone he knows? Like, oh, I don't know, himself? Da, da, da! Authors do that, you know. No, David. David's mom always says, no, David! Oh, oh, oh. We're gonna have to repaint that wall. Oof. No, David! Oh, no, not the cookies up on the top shelf and you're on the chair and then you're gonna teeter totter over and break your head. No, David, no! Not all over the freshly cleaned floor! Oh, David. No, David, no. No, no, no! I mean, playtime is awesome, but we are going a little berserk on the high seas here, and we're going to turn the house into a small ocean. Quack, quack. And then the sharks will take over, and then... <sighs> Nobody wants sharks swimming around their house. Come back here, David! Oh, this one. He likes to run around naked. I know some kids who like to do that. They like to be free. David, be quiet! Oh, looks like maybe he should join the band. I mean, he's got rhythm. Don't play with your food. Oh, but... Really, that looks like an art sculpture, if you think about it. A brand new Mr. Potato Head, if you will. Don't try this at home. That's enough, David. Well, at least he's eating his, his lean chicken and his vegetables. That's the positive side, even if it, he is eating mm, maybe all the food. Go to your room. Oh, no. Without finishing watching the superhero movie? Wah, wah. Settle down! Well, but I mean, now he's just reenacting the superhero movie. Clearly, poor Teddy over here is about to fall off the bed. Stop that this instant, ew. Ew, I'm just gonna pass that page really quickly. It's kind of gross. Put your toys away. Oh, I know, he's just completely focused on watching his woo -woo space program, but boy, if you start stepping on those little green men or that horn or that dino, ouch, everybody will be unhappy. Oh, not in the house, David. No, 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 no. Ball, outside. Play, good, outside, better. Yes. I said no, David. Oh, uh, no. David, how could you? Not the vase. Not the flower vase with the big... I told you to play baseball outside! Davy, come here. Come here with your big eyes and your sad expression. Yes, David. I love you. So see, he did get a yes where it counted. In the loving arms of his mom. I want to see this author's note that I just passed by at the very beginning. A few years ago, my mom sent me a book I made when I was a little boy. It was called No David, and it was illustrated with drawings of David doing all sorts of things he wasn't supposed to do. The text consisted entirely of the words No and David. They were the only words I knew how to spell. <sighs> do you see what this means? That means that this author, David, wrote his first book when he was just a kid, and he grew up to become like a very famous, successful writer. So yes, David, you take all that creativity and then you do something positive with it. See, he made something as opposed to destroy something. I see what you're getting at. 
oh, what am I getting at Green Bear? That I'm supposed to take all my energy and do positive things with it. Like, like what? Like run for president! Yes, yes, Green Bear for president. I will channel all my energies into running for president. Uh, right after I have that chocolate cake. Wah. Well, I better go because sometimes Green Bear doesn't take no for an answer. See you next time, kid, on Kid Time Story Time. Hey.